I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Hello, CV. This is Brittany and Autumn with your announcements for today, September 18, 2017. Anyone needing senior project hours should contact Mr. Pace at the Center Township Senior Apartments. Please see Ms. Jones for more information. Mrs. Wagle will be starting a crochet club and needs newspapers if anyone has extras to donate to the art room. Any current or former language student who would like to be in French, German, and Spanish club should give $2 to your respective language teacher by Friday, September 22nd. Attention all NHS members. Please check your email for important announcements. Please read and respond to Ms. Jones. Anyone in grades 9 through 12 interested in going out for the gymnastics team this winter season should sign up in the main high school office by Friday, September 22, 2017. Also, any high school student interested in participating in the archery team can sign up to the Central Valley Archery Team at gmail.com email address. Starting today, CV Spirit Towels will be going on sale during second lunch and in the athletic office. The towels are Carolina Blue and will cost $5 a piece. All proceeds will be donated to the Butera Family Foundation. Please see Donald Gabe Samanji for more information. Ms. McCracken and Ms. Kramer will be selling the 2017 t-shirts during both lunches today and tomorrow. Shirts are $10 for sizes small through extra large, $11 for double XL, and $12 for triple XL. Checks can be made out to CVHS. Do you like to travel? You are invited to participate in an international travel opportunity to London, Paris, Florence, and Rome. This invitation is open to any high school student. We will be fundraising throughout the year to help with the cost. There is a parent-student meeting scheduled on October 3rd at 6 p.m. in the high school library. RSVP to Ms. Delon in room North A202 or B email. The high school library will be open all this week to any student with a pass. If you wish to visit, please stop by the library during the day in order to get a pass that you can give to your academic study hall teacher. Today, the cafeteria will be serving a Philly steak and cheese sub with peppers and onions. Tomorrow, they will be serving macaroni and cheese with a dinner roll. That's all for your announcements today, CV. Here's Danny and Nico with your sports. Hey CV, Danny and Nico here to recap a big weekend in sports. On Friday, the football team beat North Catholic 52-28 with five different players scoring to contribute the big team win. On Saturday, the boys soccer team ran the score up against Southside, defeating them 7-2. Also on Saturday, the volleyball team defeated Montour to win the MAC tournament. Tonight, the MAC champs take on Bishop Canavan at home at 7.30. Today, the Boys Golf has individual qualifiers at Rolling Acres Golf Course, while Girls Golf takes on Swickley Academy at Allegheny Country Club. Girls Tennis has a match against Quaker Valley away today, and the girls soccer team has a big section matchup tonight against Ambridge at home at 7 o'clock. That's all for your sports. Now here's Michael and Noah with a special segment about our school's resource officer. Oh, well hello CV. Didn't see you guys there. Alright, so this year we were given news that there was going to be a resource officer in the building every day until we leave. Some teachers and students might have questions about why we need an officer, and some might feel safe about having one here. Mark and I decided to interview this officer himself and the other students about this topic. Hi CV, I'm here for Officer Hill. Nice to meet you. You too, sir. Uh, what is your usual time schedule for a day here at Central Valley? Uh, 7 to 3. 7 to 3. Uh, what is your biggest safety priority for Central Valley? Um, just trying to make sure that all the doors are secured and that uh, you know, any issues anyone has, they can come see me and yeah. help them out. Nice. Uh, are you here every day or do you switch with other officers to come here? No, I am now the school resource officer for to further notice, but I'll be here every day. Nice. Uh, so do you think that we should have metal detectors in Central Valley? What's your opinion on that? Um, it would be nice to have. But I think most of the students here in Central Valley seem to be pretty safe and honest. Uh, how long have you been a police officer? 15 years. Jeez. Uh, is there any advice you'd like to give the students of CV? Um, just uh, listen to your teachers and uh, have respect in the hallways. And uh, everyone try to get along with all the good year. Thank you. Yes, sir. You're welcome. I'm here with my good friend, Noah Joseph, and I'm going to ask him a few questions. So now, do you feel safer that there's a resource officer in the building all day now? 
Uh, yeah, definitely. I feel like uh, with him being around, uh, it stops people from acting like idiots. Uh, yeah. It creates a lot safer environment, and it creates a nice flow of movement. Nice. Uh, do you think the flow of traffic has changed since the coffee was in there? Uh, definitely. I can see him at uh, the corner guiding traffic and making sure there's an even flow of it. Uh, do you think we should have metal detectors yet? No. Uh, whether the cop was here or not, uh, I don't think we need metal detectors. I think our school district is safe enough and uh, trusting enough to have no metal detectors. Yeah, I'm here with uh, Jocelyn, and Jocelyn, do you feel safer now that there's a resource officer in the school? Uh, not really. You don't feel safe at all? Do you, uh, do you think we should have metal detectors here at CD? Yes. Do you feel that we need metal detectors? Mm -hmm. And, um, do you think the flow of traffic has changed a lot since the college has been here? Um, I think it's stayed the same for the most part. That's good. I'm here with Hannah Miller, and, uh, Hannah, do you feel safer that there's a resource officer here all day now? Yes, I do, because people are crazy. Nice. Do you um do you think we should have metal detectors here at CD? Um. Yeah. Yeah, I do. Because people can like sneak in a gun so easily. Yeah. Like that, it's scary. And um, do you think the flow of traffic has changed much since the cop has been here? Um, it's more clogged. It's more clogged. Yeah. After interviewing the officer and other students, we found a good amount of different opinions. Some students believe that we need metal detectors. Others trust our school safety. Those students have said that they feel safe with an officer in the building. We also found that Officer Hill is our permanent resource officer for the whole school district. That's it. See, we have a great day.